my name is Agnes Peck and I'm doing missionary work here in Uganda with my husband. We come out in this community and we buy beads from these ladies every month. Before they started making the beads, life was so hard for them. They needed to have shelter, they needed food, they needed uh, school fees. So with all that, it pushed them to go to the quarry. Yes, I'm Ross Achiro. I'm from Northern. Why we came here? Because of the war, which has made us to run away from our village to come here in Kampala. Know what to do. You can go to a stone, a stone quarry, you dig, you dig the stone, you crash, and then you get money. Quarry can kill you. Because when you, you dig the holes, Sometimes it comes a scarf like this. It kills very many. So even at the quarry, they didn't get their answer there because life was very difficult. They could crush the stones from morning to sunset, getting 200 shillings. And that's even lesser than a dollar a day. So even if they are sick, they took even their kids in order to survive. They looked really hopeless when I met them. God has so seen the way we were suffering, and I thank God very much for Agi. What Agi is doing, it, it has helped a lot. You know, God touched my heart when I reached out and found these women in the situation where, which they were in. Because even me, myself, I used to live in a slum, so when I met these women, I remembered what I, I went through. That's how I got a heart of helping them, in that when God bless, blessed me. I sat down with them, I shared the gospel with them, I encouraged them, and we started out this business. And that's why you see now they're happy. They can take their kids to school now. They can pay the house rent. But God is good that now you can see that God has changed their lives. They can take care of themselves. This group of women, every Friday we are gathering, we pray, and we praise God. When I came and bought our beat, we feel so glad. <laughs>